A P-TECH program provides students an opportunity to receive both a high school diploma, an industry-based certification, and or an associate's degree. The hallmark of a P-TECH program is its career focus and opportunity for work-based education. We offer three programs of study for our Agriculture, Food, and Natural Resources P-TECH program. They are Animal Science, Plant Science, and Agricultural Engineering. Through the AFNR P-TECH, students will earn certifications such as the TVMA Certified Veterinary Assistant Level 1, AWS Welding Certification, and the TSFA Floral Design Certification, plus many more. Careers in the animal and veterinary science pathway are high skill and high wage. Jobs could include livestock handlers, veterinary assistants, or animal nutritionists. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment of veterinary assistants and laboratory animal caretakers is projected to grow 10% through the year 2026. This pathway will feature the veterinary assistance program, but we do have a general animal science option as well. For the veterinary assistance program, students will practice and demonstrate skills in the practicum course where they will be supervised by a DVM. Upon completion of skills and hours, students must pass an exam given by the Texas Veterinary Medical Association to successfully become Certified Veterinary Assistant Level 1. The general animal science option will focus on animal husbandry and production. Careers in the agricultural engineering pathways are high skill, high wage, and in demand. Jobs could include sales representatives, inspectors, agricultural engineer technicians, or farmer ranch managers. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, one in seven Americans work in agriculture-related jobs. Students in the agriculture engineering pathway will learn the basic safety procedures of welding and woodworking and will be able to exhibit their skills at various ag mechanic competitions. Students will also have the opportunity to get real-world experience through the practicum or internship courses at the senior level. Careers in the plant science pathway are in demand. Jobs could include florists, greenhouse workers, irrigation specialists, or crop advisors. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, employment of conservation scientists and foresters is projected to grow soon. This pathway will feature floral design and landscape management. Students in this pathway will showcase their skills through the practicum courses as seniors by working side by side with industry professionals. The Laredo Martin FFA is committed to the individual student, providing a path to achievement in premier leadership, personal growth, and career success through agricultural education. National FFA continues to cultivate future generations of leaders that will help its members develop their own unique talents and explore their interests in a broad range of agricultural career pathways. So today, we are not just future farmers and ranchers, but we are the future biologists, chemists, veterinarians, engineers, and entrepreneurs of America too. FFA offers more than just animal-based projects. There are opportunities to exhibit and develop different strengths through leadership and career development events. According to Texas FFA, LDEs focus on creating situations for members to demonstrate their abilities in public speaking, decision-making, communication, and knowledge of agriculture-related topics. CDEs help students showcase their classroom knowledge by challenging them to put into real-world practice and testing them during competitions. I have eight years of experience with FFA, and throughout these years, I've gained a lot of tools and a lot of opportunities. Some of those tools are time management, responsibility, and leadership skills through FFA. And the opportunities that it's brought in me are uh, opportunities to showcase my land projects at our county fair and compete in some of the rodeos that go through FFA. Hi, my name is Zoe Gonzalez, and I am in cheerleading student council, UIL Honor Society, and superintendent student advisory but I am also part of the Veterinary Assistant Program here at Martin High School. In the Veterinary Assistant Program, we get to go to local animal clinics where we get to learn many things like how to handle animals, how to handle instruments, and how to give out medications. In the Veterinary Assistant Program, this will help me learn and grow to become a veterinary assistant in the future. Working at the veterinary clinic, I have got to learn many things and it does get a little bit challenging, but you just have to learn how to deal with it and how to put it into your day. We get to learn many things and we also get to see many cool things as well, like surgeries or any animals like that. My name is Ramiro Ramirez and I'm part of the FFA P-Tech. I'm a part of the band and stucco also. My goal in the Ag Mechanics class is to get my AWS or American Welder Society certification. 